In this video, we're going to figure out how many grams of fat there are in one pound. So the problem tells you the weight of the object. In this case, the weight is going to equal one pound. So the first thing we need to do is figure out what this weight is in units of newtons. Now, you know a direct relationship between weight expressed in units of pounds and weight expressed in units of newtons. You know that one pound is exactly equal to 4.45 newtons. Now, although I'm given a weight of one pound, and I know that one pound is 4.45 newtons, I'm just going to belabor the point and do the direct conversion. So again, I'm given the weight equals one pound. And then what I'm going to do is I'm going to multiply this by my conversion factor, which says that one pound is exactly equal to 4.45 newtons. And you should notice that this unit of a pound cancels out with this unit of a pound. And you're given an SI weight of 4.45 newtons. Now the next step is to apply our relationship that says weight expressed in units of newtons is equal to the mass of an object times the gravitational acceleration here on Earth. Now in this problem, we're given the weight, and you should already know what the gravitational acceleration here on Earth is expressed in meters per second per second. So what we need to do is we need to divide both sides of this equation by the gravitational acceleration to solve for the mass term. So what you do to one side of an equation, you do to the other. And what you should see is the gravitational acceleration on this side cancels out, and you get an expression for your mass in terms of the weight that you're given, divided by the gravitational acceleration here on Earth. Now the next step is to plug in the information that we know. We know that the weight of one pound of fat is equal to 4.45 newtons. And then we're going to divide that by 9.8 meters per second per second, or meters per second squared. Now when you divide 4.45 newtons by 9.8, you get 0 0.454 kilograms. So one pound of fat has a mass of 0 0.454 kilograms. Now in America, we tend to talk about fat content in terms of grams. So we're going to convert 0 0.454 kilograms over to units of grams. Now you should know that one kilogram is exactly equal to 1,000 grams. And then what happens is this unit of kilogram cancels out with this unit of kilogram, and you multiply 0 0.454 by 1,000, and you get 454 grams. So one pound of fat has exactly 454 grams in it.